Hey Crafty Fam, welcome back. Today we're setting up an 8 foot backdrop stand, so let's get into the supplies. So first we want to start with our layout. We're going to place all of the poles together by putting the wide mouth end into a narrow end. And then with our two crossbar pole ends, we're going to make sure those two are next to, next to each other at the bottom because that's what we'll use to assemble the feet. Now once you have all of your poles connected, you just want to make sure that the um, narrow end and the wide end are lined up together so you'll be able to put the screw in like this. And then once you have the circle fully laid out, you're going to use the screws to assemble. And this is the ring nut and the washer, and we already have our screw in, so we're going to place one washer over the screw and then use the ring nut to secure the screw and tighten everything together. Now, once you have all of your washers and screws, and wing nuts in place, you're going to want to put the legs on. Now the legs have these two holes on each of them and that will be used to connect to the crossbar. So as you can see, each crossbar has two holes and each leg has two holes. And so we'll use those holes to connect together, just like we did with the pole. So here are the, here's one leg, and we're going to line up the holes, put a screw into one of the holes, placing the washer and the wing nut on one side, and then just tightening that screw down. And then we're going to do the second hole, same way. And then once you have your whole stand assembled, you're going to get ready to stand it up on the weight side. Um, it's very, very light, so you really don't need much help, but if you want to have someone help you, you just flip it over onto the leg side, stand it up like so. And then you can move this anywhere you need to to start placing your balloons or whatever decorations you want onto the legs. And it's pretty sturdy, it can hold up to 100 pounds, but the more weight you add to it, you will have to lay down the base because it's not a weighted base on the stand. Ways that you can style a stand like this, and next we are going to break everything down. Thanks for watching guys.